Is the green economy part of the problem or part of the uh, solution? I say it's very much so not a real solution. We need def definitely different solutions to mitigate climate change, to overcome resource scarcity, to overcome poverty. I think this um, green economy is an attempt to make uh, green renewables and other industries more profitable. Uh, but it's not really a new paradigm or a new idea how we organize our economy within a constrained world. Uh, there are many false solutions offered by the green economy. On the other hand, um, if you name renewables energy green or if you are looking towards strategies like uh, ecologically sound agriculture, uh, that, that is something we definitely need and we have to get a greening uh, world economy, that's for sure. But the green economy concepts right now are not really offering the right direction. Um, I think it's a wrong solution to use financial market mechanisms in order to uh, promote environmentally uh, sound activities. Uh, the issue is very much so that liquidity is around, financial liquidity is around uh, the world and uh, that financial capital is looking for new investments, for new assets. They want to buy, they want to trade. And I think uh, nature and ecosystem services are not uh, uh, should not be sold to the financial markets. They are not, not tradable goods. Yeah? I think nature is something else than a tradable good and we should not really enter into a new phase of marketized uh, nature. Um, when, I, when it comes to the UNEP's pathway to a green economy, I very much criticize, together with many, many people in the world, that that UNEP report does not address at all the social dimension of development, it does not address at all uh, human rights, and I think uh, any green economy, if we name it green or not, uh, any transitional strategy towards a greener, more resource efficient economy, has to address uh, and has to be embedded in democratic um, participatory processes and one has to assure that uh, green economy and green investments are not doing harm to people and so human rights violations uh, have to be addressed or I would say the human rights fr framework has to be addressed when it comes to transformative or any transitional strategy and this is something we're criticizing heavily that UNEP and other reports do not address at all the social dimension, the human rights dimension. so-called TEEP report, the economics of biodiversity um, and ecosystems, uh, is a report that really led the foundation for the marketization and economization of nature. They clearly say nature is um, is, is, is destroyed because it has no uh, price, uh, it's not visible because it's not part of the market economy and I think this already starts with a very false assumption. Ecosystem services are really important and I think governments have to give appreciation to ecosystem services but ap giving, giving ap uh, appreciation to ecosystem services for me does not mean uh, to marketize it, to commodify it. Uh, it has, uh, there are other ways of appreciating the nature by protecting it, for example, to extend uh, uh, natural reserves, to say no to investments in natural uh, areas, they are still not destroyed, protect indi indigenous people's uh, life uh, uh, basis. Uh, that would be the answers, yeah? but the answer again is um, market, it's a financial market and I think it's the wrong path.